Well, I think the, you know, first of all, uh, you have to go back to 2008. 2008, uh, we held the line in duck. We were the only school in the country that didn't increase tuition, fees, or room and board. And so this time, uh, the legislature, uh, they didn't, I didn't think that they gave us a, a bonus for being such good people, you know, and that we got a little extra money. It wasn't a bad session, but uh, there were schools that increased uh, more uh, uh, than, you know, that didn't hold the line, and, that, and they, uh, they did just fine also. And we had to look at, at uh, where we're going with research and paying our faculty, and we just had to make the increase. Uh, but if you look at that, we had less than, it average, averages out less than 5% uh, each year. And that uh, we wish we didn't have to, but for us to be tier one, we've got to get our faculty salaries up so we recruit the best. And we have to have good research facilities because Tier one really doesn't mean anything other than research. You know, when I uh, when I came here, we had lost students three years in a row. We'd been going down in enrollment, and I I thought I was naive. I was naive, and I thought, well, we'll turn this around first year. Uh, I mean, it's like turning a battleship, and we were able to start the turn, and we're we've increased. This year we will have our best increase and may well, by the final day of uh, registration and everything, we may well have the largest class, the, the largest uh, enrollment that we've ever had in Texas Tech. And we found that, that the increase, which you say, well, 9% in the, yet you look at the money, we went from about $7,400 um, well, a little less than 7,400 to around 7,800. Mm -hmm. And so it was more, but we're talking about, depending on how many hours you're taking, around 300 to $400 more a semester. Mm -hmm. We wish it hadn't been that, but that is uh, something that we can live. Yeah. That's part of it uh, that's laid out in the uh, legislation that passed in House Bill 51 and also the, the other legislation that will be uh, implemented through a constitutional amendment. Mm -hmm. And uh, so that's that's important we to get get that left. But our goal is a hundred million uh, over the next several years. Mm -hmm. We want to go beyond that. Mm -hmm. So we're going to be aggressive. Well, we want to expand on some things that we've done uh, in in regards to uh, pulse power. That we've uh, tried to set up a, a method that uh, troops will have a mechanism that will set off IEDs before troops get to them, stop roadside bombings. That would be huge. Uh, in the fight against terrorists. And that uh, if you look what we're doing is, is uh, as far as cotton research and that we're bringing in uh, additional experts in the area of cotton genetics. Uh, and we have the top uh, researcher in cotton genetics in the nation right now. We're bringing in other people. Mm -hmm. And so those are just some of the examples of things we can do research that will help everyone.